Hello everyone. Today we have Mr. Nitesh Gupta, one of our successful alumni of 2010 uh, batch. Currently, he is working as a team lead in Wipro Technology, and I am Tupali Jain. I am a second year student of KIT Group of Institution. Going to have some talk with him. So you are most welcome, sir. I am very delighted to join you, sir. We would like to have few words from you and started with your introduction. So can you please introduce yourself to our viewers? Yeah, sure. The Bali. Yeah, hi. Uh, as you already said, that I completed MCA from KIT at 2010, and uh, in Wipro there was my campus placement. Uh, after that, I worked so many projects uh, in different companies also. Right now. Again in the Wipro, and working with the one of the prestigious client Airtel Africa. Okay, sir. Yeah. Sir, uh, sir, how you, do you think the role of kite in your current career and stage? Uh, yeah, the pilots play a very very important role in my life because the opportunity gave provided by the college, the environment, uh, the practicals, the Technologies and the guidance of the teachers—they really play a very important role in my life and help me a lot to survive in this corporate culture. So my question is, what what are the skills we should learn in a college time that uh, other than academics, which would uh, make us stand different from the crowd? Can you please guide us? Uh, look, the Pali that. There are so many technologies are uh, right now companies are using, but as we can see that post uh, COVID or uh, in the current scenario, that uh, RPA, AI, and uh, data science is a very hot topic right now, and uh, so many companies are start working on them, and uh, they are also establishing some data lab, uh, which will be very useful for in the near future. Uh, so rpa the robotic process automation ai machine learning and uh, data science these are the very hot topic for today okay so malam uh, okay sir uh, so my next question is uh, many students have the query that if we want to learn any technology then how should they do they should uh, start with the project on that technology or just by reading through the course material and the coding in that technology oh uh, there might be some different views if you ask this question from the multiple users but in my opinion you just start working on the project just start working on the project and doing while it's learning because it's very helpful even uh, when i was in in the mca uh one of our teacher that directly assigned me a project in a dotnet technology and at that time i really don't know how to open a dotnet in my laptop but they directly assigned to a project so while making that project i learned that dotnet and so many things and in this teachers are uh, also what helped me a lot so just start working on the projects making a projects and this is the only way you can learn the things effectively and uh, practically okay a uh, project plays a vital role in learning yeah sure yes sir okay thank you sir so mr gupta uh, please tell me, uh, please aware us about the current corporate culture and the challenges we are going to uh, face as a fresher so we can improve ourselves um uh, as you know that currently in corporate that due to covid there's a so many hiccups are going on uh so actually what companies are exactly want from the fresher that they must be uh, driven the new solutions and uh, optimize the uh, the codes that what they exactly want is as we already know that code are available on internet no everybody can use yes. but there is a lack of optimization and the accuracy this is the main problem and now companies are struggling with data also they have the data but they are struggling how to manage it so data warehousing uh, 
as my suggestion that you should fo- focus about on data where we are housing also data we are housing okay sir sir as we are fresh we have so many questions in our mind like uh, i think a common question for everyone that uh, we are not good enough in coding then how we will manage our job and also if someone have coding skills but do not have the communication skills or matlab that much well uh, what are your what are your suggestions to our viewers actually it uh, if you want to survive in it it doesn't mean that you know how to code it doesn't mean that uh, what generally freshers are thinking that coding is the only thing uh, which help them to survive in it field no it's not because only uh, in it field only 10 to 20% employees are doing coding the rest of the 80% employees are doing various uh, various various things like they are providing a support uh, they are working on the optimization they are working on the cons- consultant cons- consultancy and uh, some uh, hiring process technical skills technical writing all all this there are so many things so if someone is not be good in coding but that person should be a uh, very good in how to apply a logic the logic should be clear it doesn't mean in in which language but logic should be clear and uh, for communication part yes yeah, play a very important role in it field uh, if someone is lacking in that uh, he or she should be working on that sir okay uh, that will definitely help our viewers who have this kind of mis- misconceptions Yeah. Uh, sir, uh, please tell something. Uh, some essential points across an interview. Interviews. You must be focus about uh, the subjects. As you know, that company has already know that you are the future. They doesn't expect it so much from your side. But as uh, well, we were the stu- students and we were just studying in the in the college. So so many students were think that uh, subjects like operating system. dbms and uh, we don't need this one how uh, to read but these subjects are play a very important role in life especially the dbms uh, that uh, operating system the data analysis and the algorithm so start working on on that and uh, be confident the, but in technical review they generally ask a very basic questions not expected so much because you are participating as a fresher but uh, they are uh, emphasize on the logic you must know how to implement a logic because logic will be same in which uh, uh, maybe language will be different but logic will be the same uh, that means we need to improve on our logics yeah exactly okay they so gave you uh, sometime it uh, maybe happen that they gives you other real uh, real time situation and they uh, just asking you just simply write the algorithm how to solve it they don't want you to write a code uh, write a script no they just simply ask you to write a algorithm step by step uh, problem solve or solving steps that's it okay sir thank you sir sir share something about the memories of kite like with your friends faculties and others yeah there are so many memories uh, with kite but Uh, the very special one uh, when i was in the final year of the mca just i was say that uh, there is a uh, one faculty mr shashank sir uh, i think they are already uh, yes, here, sir, no? yes 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 yeah. he is sir yeah, shashank sir and uh, sangeeta ma'am they directly assigned to me a project just make a social website for a college so we start oh. working it and uh, with the help of the shashank sir we integrate our project with library uh, uh, library system also so that was really a memorable time for me in the complete last semester the complete semester is for a project so we uh, me and my team is con- uh, working in the co- college for the completely 6 months and we complete that project and that period was very memorable for Okay. That means your journey is uh, definitely great. Yeah. Yes, sir. So for you, my last question is: like uh, we all are suffering from this COVID nineteen outbreak, and we are not going. We are the students. We are not go able to attend colleges. 
so what are the challenges we are going to face after this covid 19 and how we prepare ourselves for the post covid situations oh uh... Post post COVID situation that uh, as maybe you are hearing in the news that some companies are start firing our employees because they are not getting a revenue from projects uh, due to due to COVID. But post COVID COVID for especially for the students there uh, there is an opportunity because post COVID there is so much opening opening will be there especially in the data science and the RPA RPA system. So just prepare yourself. to working on these two technologies especially there will definitely a good opportunity for you all after one year uh, okay sir data science is must yeah data not it's not must but to uh, start preparing to clear your logics for the basic logics what uh, you may have a uh, subject like data analysis and the algorithm Yes, and uh, operating system and the rdbms concepts scopes concepts so they are the very basic things but uh, many of the freshers are lack lacking in that so mm. this could be clear okay sir thank you sir thank you so much it has a great conversation with you i hope it will definitely help our students thank yeah, you for sure. giving your precious time to us yeah thank you dipal thank you sir